Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. Also check me out on Twitch as Floyd Mason. I'm, I'm having the worst luck today. Um, so, I think I got everything. I did refill up the timer and the tracker and hopefully it's pretty close. Um, looks pretty... Oh, also have shadow. I forgot about that. Um, oh, uh, beans aren't on here, so that's fine. I think I got it all. Psh. Don't know how much we lost there. Do I, I think, uh, let me check out the spirit boss key. I don't. Oh, wait, do I have the Goron tunic? I do. Okay. So I think all I lost was going to do the scrubs. It's not the worst. <clears throat> not ideal, not the worst. But uh, I will say if it goes down one more time today, then that's, that's it. I can only deal with so much. Just my luck, haven't streamed for, for forever. And uh, this, is, this is what happens on my first day or I have a whole afternoon and evening to do it. Uh, boy. Hey, Dr. Leandra. How's it, how's it going? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I am having terrible... I'm actually having a really, really good seed. The seed is quite friendly, for the most part. But I'm having the worst computer luck today. Very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. Yeah. Well, first, first my internet wasn't working, and so it kept, like, logging me in and out. So I had all these, like, 12-second videos I had to delete. Um, so then I just went and took a break, and then my computer just blipped and crashed. So, luckily I didn't lose too much progress, but still annoying. In the real game? This is in here. I, I don't have any, um, I don't have anything shuffled, so that's, that's what's in here in the real game. really just some scrubs like in the real game the scrubs sell you garbage so they're not like they're not great you don't need to talk to any of them really and like I don't mean garbage but like they sell you like I think like some upgrades and stuff so yeah 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 in the real game they, they sell you stuff but it's it's less exciting <clears throat> Um, like in the real game, you get like upgrades from the mask quest. That's how you kind of get like more of things. But I think like a scrub sells you like a Deku stick upgrade. Like I think that's where you get it. I, I mean, it's been so long that I, I honestly can't remember who does what. All right, back to fire. This is where we were when we crashed. So. So for a little better luck this time. Ice arrows? Um, you get ice arrows from... Where do you get ice arrows? Uh, GTG. The the end, end thing of GTG is ice arrows. I'm pretty sure. Like, GTG is just, like, there's nothing in there. It's just for kind of an added challenge thing. Like, it's, it's unlike the other ones, uh, like Bottom of the Well and um, the Ice, uh, GTG is not required to beat the game. <clears throat> so it's just, it's just a whatever item. Man, it's really gonna be fun cutting all these videos together. God damn. 
God damn you, computer. And internet. And Twitch. Just wanna have a little fun. That's all I want. Again, if it goes down again, I'm done. Done for. Let's go hang out my pool. I don't need I don't need this. Well, it is windy out, and I get a little nervous being in there, because, like, there's some big trees overhead, and, like, I looked out, like, two hours ago, and I'm definitely going to have to skim it again. <clears throat> Seem to skim it, like, three times a day, because so much crap falls in it from the trees. We have, like, a solar blanket, which I should really start putting on it, so that I have to dig less crap out of it, but then I also have to would, I would have to put it on every night, which is a thing in itself. So. Tough to say. Tough to say which is more worth my time. <laughs> Nothing so far in fire. Again, I'm not... I am definitely leaning towards the fact that GTG has something today. Um, I have four keys, I can do most of the stuff there. And the Gruda membership was on the uh, way to Hero. But I was down near fire, so... Figured I'd dip fire, because I, I had four keys. So it gets me up pretty far. Not too bad. And unfortunately, having five keys is probably the best time to enter fire, because it gets you the shortcut. I think. I think five. It's a pretty deep shortcut. But three more items here, one more item through the next next door, so still enough stuff. And again, if I get ne if I get absolutely nothing, then I will be very slow to come back to fire. Like fire will be a last resort type uh, type of situation. But I'm still hoping two hours. Like again, if we get <clears throat> if we get iron boots, we can go finish water. Um, and if we got hammer and fire key, we can finish fire, and then then we just have to get lights, which we'll at least get a hint on. So I'm hopeful that we're in good shape. I want an item here or not. Like, I do because I put in the time to come here. But at the same time, if I get nothing, then I'll feel good about not coming back here. Ooh, nice trap. Also, should have grabbed another drink while it was uh, rebooting itself, but what a good do. I think about what I want for dinner, too. Again, as I was saying at the start, it, I would kill for Lee's right now. I think that's... I missed two things about living in Toronto. One was getting Lee's. Just because I feel like their spice of the meal I got was like the perfect level of heat for me. And I missed my dive bar. That's about it. And that's about it. Oh, Leandro, the game I, I just started um, yesterday that I was telling you about, Pokemon Monroe. There's Iron Boots! Alright, we can go beat water. Worth it. Um... 
Uh, I have, it, it's kind of like five or six, I think, no, sorry, it's six little stories, about 20 minutes, half hour each. And there's kind of radio hosts and like little kind of events happen to them. Not bad, per, almost done. Um, I beat five of them. Um, and so it's okay. Like, it's not one, you know, that I'm like, oh, like you should definitely have to go and try it. But like, I like the stories. They're kind of cheesy, but you know, it's an easy kind of, it, similar to kind of like Erica. Except that it's um, small little stories. <laughs> but, you know, it's the kind of thing you can, like, replay as well. Now, I know I said I was going to go to GTG. But... I'm actually going to go to water. So. Because uh, we can get... Get all. S yeah, now we can get everything because we can uh, do diving in the lab as well. So, I'm actually going to save it real quick. I'm now scared. That's going to crash again. <clears throat> um, but yeah, I'm definitely going to beat Poem on Road tonight. And then I think the trophies are. <laughs> are you now a hater of the Water Temple? The Honestly, I get it. Um, once you know how to do the Water Temple, it's not nearly as bad. But the problem is, is if you put the water up and you miss getting a chest, then you have to go through the entire water cycle again. And that's, that's what makes it so crappy. It's like, oh, if I didn't know to go into the secret room when the water was mid-level. Go play more Little Hope? Yeah. I, I actually kind of forgot that was out. Because, um, like, I, I loved Until Dawn. And then Man of Medana only beat once, but again, I wanted 100% it, because it's easy enough to do. Just didn't see the hole in the middle. Yep, 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 yep. Um, so I will look into getting a little hope. For sure. Come on. Come on. Also, I feel like my aim is backwards. Oh my god, come on. There we go. Don't know why I was struggling so much with that. Yeah, it feels inverted. I don't know. It probably isn't. Because, like, nothing would have changed. This is probably how it always is, but... Maybe I just... Maybe I was playing something else that was inverted? Oh, also, I'm trying to decide if I want to... Um... We'll do fishing after. I want to get over here. Mike's good. Um... Because now that I beat... Like, I beat FF10. Um... Which, again, like, I... I, for the most part, enjoyed it. The story is really good. Um, the f the fighting is I, like I find the the battles enjoyable. I'm just not a big fan of the leveling system or the weapon system. Um, but they in no way ruin it. But I'm trying to decide because I have a game where I'm basically at sin, like my original game. Like I'm I have the airship, so I'm almost on the game. But I hated that check fight so goddamn much. That's like, do I want to try and quickly level up and beat that one as well? Or do I just go, nah. Oh yeah. Like, I'm going to play X2 again soon. Because again, it's it's the... I have the... Um, the remastered one. So I've never... I've beat X2 version on the PS2. I haven't beat the PS3 version. But I'm going to rip off a couple of quick... Quick games. Well, they're different files, so it's a di like it's it's a thing where I could 
probably in maybe like an hour knock another game off my li off my list and have it beaten. You know? But I honestly have like so many games coming right now from Limited Run. Oh, did you? Nice. PS2 was probably the system... No, no that, that's a lie. PS3 was the system I played the most. But PS2 I played so much. It was so good. PS3 was just what I had in university, so I could play non-stop all the time. But I used to play so much PS2. It was such a great, a great, great system. Man, I'm a little bummed. Um, like, when I went to St. Fran, I took my DS, and the joystick broke on it. It, like, cracked in half from playing Kingdom Hearts. Um, so now I need to... I've been meaning to... I need somebody to try and fix my Xbox because it's completely dead and I want someone to just put my memory, like the memory so I have the games I beat into a new one. But now I have to see if someone can fix that joystick as well, which sucks. I, I can't personally, but I, I think it would be pretty easy for someone to do it. Like you just have to... Because the problem is it's cracked down the middle so it keeps sliding off <clears throat> whenever I spin it too much. So, I, like, I honestly was putting it back on, and I'd play for, like, another half an hour. But, yeah, I'll have to see if I can find someone who who can do it for me. It's kind of a bummer. Alright, so we're going to go... Again, we don't have... Don't have the water tunic, but I should be fine. I have, I have quite a bit of hearts that I should need it. So we're gonna check the key one first, because um, there's two checks in there. So if neither one's good, then it's fine. I don't want to do the other one yet because I don't have Song of Time anyway, so I can't do all the checks. So it would not be a good use of my of my keys. Surprise, like, I've been looking for someone to do my Xbox for, like, years. And, like, I haven't even beaten that many games on it, but I beat both Halos. And I think I beat Halo 1 on a higher difficulty. Um, I feel like I have three forest keys. Let me check that. Yeah, I have three keys. Just missed that. Um, but I also put, like, a ton of time. I loved the Gauntlet Legends on Xbox. And again, trying to 100% everything, um, there's like 20 characters, and I beat it with like 13 of them. So it's kind of like, eh. That's also a weird one. Because like, there's certain games where, even if there's a bunch of characters, you don't need to 100% beat it with them. Um, but Gauntlet Legends is one. Doing something like, uh, like Borderlands, again, as I was talking to Cosmic about earlier is I wouldn't consider it 100% beat unless I 100% beat each character. But I only did 100% them on a lower difficulty and beat it with one of them on a harder difficulty. So, but again, I think your levels carry over, so I would 100% beat it on the higher difficulty eventually. <clears throat> Boom. <laughs> What you got? Bam! You got blooped. Again, pretty good on items. Like, I feel like it wants me to beat water and spirit. I feel like that's what's gonna be. I feel like forest, fire, and shadow are the three not being beat today. So here's what well, key scum before we go in here. But there's only two items. Really quick check. If either one's good, then we can use our keys up up top. <clears throat> I'll show you a nice little uh, skip in here. Super nice. Because I hate that room over there. That room sucks. But you can just go here. Easy peasy. One of my favorite skips in the game, honestly. 
<sighs> Again, I'm still collecting them. I know 40 is crap, but I never got a hint for 50 yet, so... Well, I mean, again, we'll see what's in this room, because I might just not have... keep them. Yes, assuming you have hovers, absolutely. I'm talking about... I'm talking about, uh... Running randos. For anyone... anyone watch this who's gonna run a rando, that's one of my favorite skips. Alright, and we'll just reset. Oh, did, did you did you end up beating the game? I mean, I didn't. I've been kind of out of the loop, being in San Fran and stuff. I've not been watching as many videos. But did you finish, Sheld? Uh, which temple did you do first, Spirit or Shadow? Spirit. Interesting. I so I ask. Because up until not that long ago, I thought you had to do Shadow first. I've always done Shadow first. I always save Spirit to the end. And then I was... Sorry, it wasn't that long ago, but me and my buddy did a race <clears throat> of Ocarina Time many, many years ago when we first moved to Toronto. And I was so confused um, when he did Spirit first because I didn't know you could do it. I was just like, dude, what are you doing? And he's like, spirit. And, uh... Uh, okay, I mean, that's fair. Like, I think, like, well, you can tell by here, right? Like, by the, the songs in order that spirit is actually before shadow. Like, you are supposed to do spirit first, in theory. But I never knew that. And like, you can do shadow first. So I always did it first. All right. I mean, it is kind of cool that you can do either one and they don't matter. And I don't think you get anything in either one of them that helps you in the other temple. Like, I don't even... I don't even really know what you get in Shadow. Well, I guess you get Hover Boots in Shadow, but they don't really help. They help a little in Spirit, maybe. Like, <clears throat> you can use them to get some of the Sculptulas and stuff easier, but not a big deal. Man, water is sucking it up. I will say, it's always annoying when water and fire don't have anything in them. Because they are kind of a... They are more annoying to do. Like, at least with, like, Forest and Shadow, like, you feel like you're still... You're making progress towards the boss. Where it's like, I could have just gone to the boss. Like, the boss is not tied behind things. Get the hint for the well. So I did that. I got the lens. They crossed the desert. Yeah, fair enough. I guess that's true. You need either way. You need to do. Um, you need to get the lens. Kind of didn't realize that. You need the lens for both. I make the jump under the hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it'd make it easier for sure. So nice too is I have three keys, so like, well, I could do the cheat around the door. I don't need to. I have an extra key that I don't need. So. Oh. I know that this is nothing. For some reason I got a clue about it, but it was something pointless. But we're here, so who cares. Oh, it's so nice. I think one of the nicest things I did. I forget who I was talking to this about. Oh, yes, that is not. Um, so I was talking to somebody else who also runs this, and like, I wish they would add it to the kid as well, and you could just add whatever you want there. Like they already have have it, but if like I could just switch between like the slingshot and bombs or something, or or even like attach something to up, even for adult link, that'd be great. 
It's such an amazing feature. <laughs> Was it? Uh, I'll just tell you that I will never use Naru's love ever. It's not worth my. It's not worth my time. I mean, getting getting the half damage is super nice, though. Really, Bongo. Interesting. Yeah, he can he can be a bit of a pain, I guess. I I fight him so little. I I find um, the easiest one to die on for me is uh, Fire Boss. He he just hits he hits really hard for where you are in the game. So like you know, a couple hits and he can take you out. Like Water Boss is annoying, but I usually don't like. He probably takes me the longest, but I don't tend to die. Same with Twin Rova. Oh. Well, I also don't use the, I also don't use the lens. But I mean his eyes right in the middle. So. All right, we got to be quick here. This is the one spot I could drown in the run. But I just refuse to pay $300 for a tunic that I need for maybe this room. It's early in the game you get it cuz you don't have any hearts, but It is a bummer. Honestly, one of the main reasons I put on um, random dungeons is so I get to play Shadow. Because you, you never get to play Shadow in the randomizer. It's just, it's way too much stuff to even get in. Oh, there we go. Ice arrows. I'm um, starting to think that it's pretty empty in here. I'm, I've gotten like at least half the items and nothing's been good. But fire also sucked until I got iron boots, so. Don't want to give up yet. Again, I feel like GTG is going to have an item to beat one of the other ones. Like, I feel like it's either going to have a Forest Song, um, Hammer, or, or like, Light Arrows. So. <clears throat> Where are you at? Bam. Nope. Do, 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 do. Because this is, I mean, and again, I don't know if this is a key or not, but this is the easiest one to miss. <clears throat> is going back in here and getting this chest. Oh, wrong side. It's just like when you're going up, you don't think about it. <clears throat> and I can't remember if there's a key. I don't think there's actually a key in here, but... When you're trying to get all the chests, this is the easiest one to miss. I forget about it all the time, doing randomizers. Nothing. Okay. Just gonna do a quick save, because I'm worried. Um, okay, so we got one. Second floor still. That's the boss room, which I'm not getting. That's at the bottom of that, so I'm not getting. And that's okay. Okay. Boom! Ugh, come on, game. Give me, give me something. 
for all my water temple efforts. I'm gonna go fight Dark Link. Sucks. Dark Link might be worse than, honestly, than Twin Rova. He just, he's the worst. Such, so unfun. Quick. Oh, boy, that was close. That was a close. I, I find him super annoying. I find if you don't have bigger on sword, um, like I just swing randomly. It's just like it, it's the same as uh, in like the second NES one, where he just he just kind of exists. Like I don't find there's any strategy to them. I don't find anything about him that interesting. Oops. Oh, I fucked that one up. Yeah. Um. Like, I just finally got button mash, which is so boring. <clears throat> like, Twin Robot I only don't like because she takes too long if you don't do it right. Because <clears throat> she'll just, like, won't throw out three of a type in a row. There go. Man. Water sucks. I think I only have the top ones left now. Just... Oh, yeah, cause that's fighting him. That one I'm not getting, and that one's going down with the song time. So. This part kind of sucks too because like nine times out of ten the guy jumps down and hits you on your way up and knocks you off. Whew. Dodge roll. He tried. He tried. Alright. So. <clears throat> didn't have to move the water at all. Nothing changed. Nothing in this temple. Good. Enjoy the lurk. Been in there. <clears throat> Again, it's also awesome to have uh, hover boots here. You can skip this dumb puzzle. Again, like not a, not in any means like a bad puzzle, but it's just long for the sake of being long. So just skip that right up. Pop. <laughs> And then don't grip onto that at the top. Grip onto him so he doesn't steal your shit. Uh, here we go. 
I think what sucks too is like doing this the rando. Like I'm gonna fight this dude, and then I'm immediately gonna fight Morpha. Who, like Morpha's also fine, but can be annoying. But yeah, with, with bigger on sword, he's less likely to parry your attacks. But it's just annoying when you're both swinging the same. He hits you more often than you hit him. It's just when you both have the regular sword, which is annoying. But yeah. Bigger on sword, he's super easy. Because he doesn't block as much, and he only takes four hits. So, not that bad. I make a big deal out of him, but he's not that bad. Oh, oh, there's bomb shoes. So, don't need him anymore. Um, just save quit. I feel like it's a little faster than running back. Thanks for watching. Please click to check out my other videos, like and subscribe, and come by Twitch under Floyd Mason to join my live streams.